What's good, what's good, and welcome back to Invest and Trade with Jax Polygonians. We've had a beautiful bounce once again for Matic. We're all the way up at $1.84. We're up about 6% on the day. We're sitting at a market cap of 12.69 billion. And we're sitting at a 24 hour volume of 1.44 billion. Late, oh, crypto.com put a nice little Santa hat on top of their logo. That's cute. Uh, ladies and gentlemen, if you're new to crypto.com, sign up to the world's fastest crypto growing app. You can grab one of the incredible Visa cards for cash back in crypto, free Spotify, Netflix, Prime, travel incentives. Depending on the level of card that you have, $25 for free in crypto just for signing up through my referral. So we're here on the four hour chart for Matic. We rolled over, we came back down to our buy zone at 170. So if you're using our DCA strategy, you re-entered. Currently you're up on your trade here about seven eight percent now i do this on low leverage if you want to spot trade that's definitely the safer bet um, but i'll throw my profits up on the screen here i i do this dollar cost average strategy usually on two to three x leverage so we've come up to 182 once again which is a level of resistance as you can see here you can see all the support in this area now flipped as resistance we do have a little bit of a lower high here on the rsi so that's something to keep a close eye on. If we were to trend higher, of course, we would invalidate it. And our take profit area is up here at 196. If we were to roll over, guys, do beware of a little bit of a double top. You can see here we wicked up. If we come up, we hit resistance, we roll, we can create a little bit of a double top. But we just had the bullish cross on the four hour EMA. So if we can hold the EMAs here, we're looking healthy for continuation. If we look at Matic here on the daily, we can see we're starting to hold the 20 EMA as support, which is a massive sign of strength. As you can see here, we broke back above the EMAs. We saw a nice little pump. Right here, we went through our ABC correction. We broke back and we broke back above the daily EMAs and we saw a nice little pump. So we've just gone through our ABC back down to a strong level of support, the golden ratio at 155 and we're back above the EMAs. So we could see a beautiful little pump coming up here for Matic and our next impulsive wave, you go from swing high down to swing low, would bring Matic up to the 1.618, which is sitting at 285, which is just above our previous all time high. So if we do see our next impulsive wave break our all time high here, then we will be going into price discovery. Extremely exciting times for Matic and all of Matic holders. Uh, by accident and I click the little Siri button. They're always listening. So if we can come up and we can break 196, which is a 0.786, then we can start heading up to our all time high. We're also starting to push above our neckline from our large cup and handle pattern. So if we can hold that as support, your target from this cup and handle brings you back above the previous all time high as well. It's here at 296 for Matic. There was another little pattern I was noticing here. I'll pop over to this chart. You can see here we're well on our way to our bull flag target at 256 and our falling wedge target at 281. Now we've just broken out of this trend line of resistance as you can see here. And we can drop in our line of support. So we have a little bit of a falling wedge or a descending channel here. And your target is the top of the channel, which is coming in at about 216. So do keep an eye on that as well. I do think 206 will act as a major level of resistance. So let's hop over to Ethereum. Things are looking really, really good for ETH. We're coming up to test this level of resistance at 4437. We're back above the EMAs and we're starting to break the previous all time high from back in May. I said it's really crucial guys. If we're gonna see continuation, we cannot continue to hit resistance underneath the previous all time high. We need to break above it. We need to get back above the EMAs. And we're seeing a nice little push here. So I would like to see our next daily candle close above the 20 EMA, close above 4416. And that would be a really, really strong sign that we're going to see our move to the upside. We did our Fibonacci from our last video for our next impulsive wave if we bottomed out here. And it would bring you really close to the 1.272, which is coming up at 5731. So today and tomorrow will be really important days here for Ethereum. If we close above the EMAs, we're looking really strong. We're gonna tackle a high, we're gonna head up to 4731. We have our bull run targets, 8014 and 1137 for ETH. You can see here, we put in a nice little double bottom pattern right here, and we're just coming up to the neckline right now. So we break this double bottom. You can see we're just starting to break above. 
So here would be your target. We'll bring ETH back up, break the previous all time high and bring you up to about 4926 for ETH. So we'll finish off the video here with Matic. So do watch this dollar 82. If we get back above it, we hold it as support. That's when we can head up to our take profit zone coming in at 196, which is very close to the 0.786. And we have our all time high at 222. So if we come all the way up to 196, you're looking at a juicy little trade opportunity here of about 16% for Matic. Beautiful to see us back above the EMAs. We're doing everything that we need to do. I'm gonna actually pop into this chart here. We're doing everything we need to do for continuation. ABC back above the EMAs on the daily. Break the 0.786 continuation. Break the all-time high and head into price discovery. Very exciting times. So if we pop over to the weekly time frame, you can see here on the weekly, we came right down to the 20 EMA and we bounce. That's exactly what you want to see, guys. We had a juicy pump right here. We came back down to the 20 EMA bounce. Juicy pump, come back down to the 20 EMA bounce. So we're doing everything we need to do to head up to our bull run targets. So 1.618 at 677, we have the dream price at 1181 maybe we'll go all the way up to the 2.272 we just saw sand go all the way to the 2.272 and for matic that would be all the way up at 17 dollars. that'd be absolutely incredible guys uh, but let's first make it to 677 and we'll take it from there <laughs> all right guys quick shout out to the discord over 1,000 members. We're posting chart patterns. We're talking all things crypto. It's the price of a coffee, guys. 350 USD a month. <laughs> it's a beautiful investment and it helps support the channel as well. All right. See you in the next one. Peace. Much love.